Johnny 3-1 here today, what a tremendous effort, only our second away league win of the season. Yeah, well pleased, um, I think we deserved the win. Um, it was a difficult game, difficult conditions, it's a tough place to come, as we know. Um, but I think we've done a lot of the ugly side of the game to, to give us a good, good platform, good foothold. Um, and I think our moments of quality took the game away from them in that, in that second half. So, um, yeah, job well done. Uh, pleased for everyone. Thought the boys were excellent. Matty Stevens into double figures now. Ten goals for him. Fantastic from him this season. Great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where you want your strikers, isn't it? Between the posts and um, we've created two good opportunities there. You know, the, his first one, we've asked the question. We've, we've put the ball into the box, making them defend. And then uh, his second one's a really well-worked goal where we... You know, sequence, we get Josh uh, Nerfield in a 1v1 and um, great wing play from him and Matty's there to, to finish it off. So that's where you want your forwards um, and you want your forwards scoring and both of them have done that today. Yeah, not forgetting Joe Piggott as well off to a great start for us in the early stages. Yeah, really good start. Uh, Piggy took his goal well. Was, um, it was a bit of a gift and I was glad that, 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 he, that he took it. And, uh, but I thought it was all round play today. I thought, he was, I thought he was excellent, Joe. You know, he showed, I think for me, he showed the real moments of quality in the game. Um, and that was, that was what we was trying to achieve in the second half, is to get him sort of in, in areas where they didn't want to uh, defend. And then um, he can find that pass, he can switch play, he can, he can link um, the, the defence and the attack. And I thought, uh, I thought he'd done that great too as well. He gets his goal as well, which is uh, really pleasing. And of course, you went three up top at one stage as well, bringing on Josh Kelly. Yeah, I think at that stage of the game, I felt, I felt it would help us. Um, certainly with, with our press, I think, Josh and, and Matty managed to plug their fullbacks, stop their fullbacks getting out, but he also had a real impact on the game in a positive way going forward. Um, it gave us, them, it gave, allowed us to get Joe sort of more in a ten roll and uh, and two forwards sort of running off of him, and I thought they linked up really well. And uh, I thought Josh Josh Kelly was outstanding when he came when he really was. It's a really competitive and open game, wasn't it? Yeah, it, it, it's always the way here. They're a good team. Um, I said that. I said that to you in the week. I knew this would be a tough test. Um, difficult, difficult. And the game was in the balance for, for long moments. Obviously, we had a great start and we gift them one back just before half time, which changes the complexion of the game. I think if we get in, um, if we get in at half time um, in the lead, I think maybe we, you know, we, we, we kick on from there. But we had to wait a little longer. Um, they had moments, but sort of speculative moments from distance. I think I don't think we, we got opened up. Um, at all really in that second half um, and then uh, we get positive in impact from the bench and um, and we take the game away from them so it was, a, it was a really good away performance. So important for our away form and of course as well 179 Dons fans here this afternoon. Yeah but the away form like I know we haven't been getting the results but we've you know, we've played we've played as well as that maybe better actually in games and not got what we deserve so um, I wasn't panicking about that at all but obviously it, it becomes a thing that you have to speak about and Questions that you have to answer, uh, and the boys answered that today. And uh, it's really good for the for the supporters to, to see that because I mean this is obviously a difficult place for us to get to. Um, we had the luxury of coming up on the train yesterday and staying overnight, but I'm sure some of the uh, some of the guys and girls set off early first thing this morning. I, I think I did hear that a few um, didn't make it because no. of a, a coach mishap, uh, which is a shame. Um, it's obviously gutted that, that they weren't here to see it, but um, hopefully they watched it and enjoyed it. But yeah, it was great. It was great for for, for those guys that was here because uh, it's a hell of a hell of an effort to get up it. Absolutely, and of course you brought Ed Leach as well on the bench today. Yeah, yeah, we, we, we brought Harry Hedges with us as well uh, with a travelling party, and um, obviously with with um, with Jake being out and uh, Sass being out, the others the other lads are out on loan. We needed, yeah, we need an extra body. Um, Ed's been great for the for the under 18s when he's trained with us. He's done well. So has Harry. That's why we brought him along too. Um, and they really enjoyed it. Just talking to them coming off the pitch there, they they, they loved the experience. They got to go to Eastley now Monday night and do the business um, and back it up. And then that becomes a really good couple of days for the club. Great stuff. Very well done, John. All right, cheers, Bob.